they come in and have a problem and say, oh, my wheelchair is not good or my prosthesis, and you are able to help them that they can focus uh, on their competition, on their training, or training for competition. You know, all those athletes, they were training for four years to come here. They did their best and now just short few days before competition starts, they have a problem with their uh, with their medical device and this may, be, uh, may prevent them from for competing. This is a huge problem for them and so we are happy to take away the pressure. Okay, we take care, care on your components, we take care on your medical equipment and you can focus fully on your sport, on your competition. We have a multi, multi-international, multicultural team here with technicians from Germany, Netherlands, Canada, uh, US, uh, Finland, Sweden, Japan, China. I think we have 10 or 12 countries here and they're all experienced technicians in, in their home country and we bring here together a lot of competence, a lot of knowledge and if they have very special uh, parts or special situation they come together and what would you do, what would you do, what would you do and together they find always the best solution for the athlete. Arrival days is always peak time because uh, sometimes the airlines are not so nice to wheelchairs. If you come in with flat tires it's maybe five minutes. If you come in with a, a broken frame that we have to weld it's maybe three hours. Uh, if we have to do a complete uh, uh, socket like this where we have to take the plaster and everything it's maybe two days. Every person has, has very individual uh, mm -hmm. uh, things uh, that you have to take care on. Uh, yeah, and so it's it's there is no standard, you know. It's, it's everything is different. 